Hi, so I'm vlogging today for Reality Bite for this season's Civilian Big Brother. First impressions, when it started, I thought, oh no, it's not going to be very good. But I changed my mind, I am beginning to slowly change my mind. I think I'm speaking for everyone watching. Louis G, he's just a nightmare of a person. He thinks he's the next Bear or Mark or Neil or who, you know, who I was in the house with. You can tell that's the kind of character he's trying to be. Um, there's nothing funny about him, literally whatsoever. Like, I like people who are quite highly strung and entertaining, but he's not entertaining, he's just a twat. And he's just trying so, so hard to think of things just to annoy people, but annoy them in, again, just not a funny way. I didn't like the other Lewis at first, but I have to give it to him. He's the only one who's switched on in that house and he's got everyone tipped off to a T. Like, he knows, like, how everyone operates. So I do like him for that reason, because he's quite clued up. Isaac, he's pretty harmless, although I don't like how him and that other toss pot, Lewis G, speak about Kay, they tend to like speak, I mean she's not exactly like some dolly bird, you know, who gives off some like sexual vibe, she's like quite an innocent character and they speak about her in a in an inappropriate way I think and that's, that's I'm not usually one to say things like that but I don't like how they speak about her, I think it's wrong. Isaac's well into her charm. Um, but he's way too boring for her. I wish there was another guy in there for Sharon who was kind of more on her wavelength. I think she's deaf. Her and Cameron are my two absolute favourites. I love them to bits. Cameron, because I feel like that's exactly how he acts at home. I feel like he's just so, so real. There's nothing, there's no, he's not putting anything on. Everything you see is exactly what you get without the cameras and that's what makes a good program I think anyway and I think Sean's exactly the same I think Sean's got a bit more potential but there's not I wish they'd put another northern bird in there for well there is another northern bird but I wish they'd put someone in a bit similar to her so you could see them bounce off each other what's he called now is it Kian from um, Ireland he seems lovely entertaining as well like it's all very well and good having people that are nice but you need people that are entertaining. Thomas, uh, is that how you pronounce it? I don't know, but anyway, he is lovely. And I love the fact that he's entertaining, but doesn't have a clue he's entertaining. He doesn't try to be funny. He's just innocently funny. My verdict so far would be that I think Cameron or Sean are gonna be the winners. Well, one of them will be the winner, obviously, but they're definitely gonna, one of them's gonna be the runner up, and one of them's definitely gonna be the winner. So the rest, I can't really speak about because it seemed pretty pointless. But I will be back next week. Thanks for watching.